hello it's Bailey and welcome back to my channel today I am bringing you my December TBR which the month of December is now going to be more hectic than I thought I mean I've been prepared for it to be hectic but stuff's getting real basically if you haven't heard or seen I think I've posted it on Twitter and I've talked to some people directly about this but I basically found out that I'm gonna be getting induced probably at 37 weeks which would be the week of December 16th through the 23rd so right before Christmas <laughs> so my December in which I thought I would have most of the month to still like do a couple projects and then post my end of year content it's looking like probably the last couple weeks of December I will be taking you know a planned break then so you're gonna see this December TBR and then you're gonna start seeing my like wrapping up the year videos which I'm very excited for but unfortunately there probably won't be vlogs like I was planning for December but this way I will be able to hopefully start fresh uh, January 1st and be like creating as much content as I would like so to get into what I do have planned to read for December firstly I have the shelf this book club book pick for the month which this month was picked by Rylan from Escaping Through Novels. I will link her down below and I'm very excited for this one because she picked a true crime and it is I'll Be Gone in the Dark by Michelle McNamara. I'm very much looking forward to this one. This is about the Golden State Killer. As of now the live show is planned for probably December 17th as long as uh, I don't get induced before then. That is the week of my induction but I don't think that they'll have me come in on Thursday or Friday. I'm hoping more like Monday, Tuesday. Uh, so that that live show date is subject to change but as of now it is most likely going to be the 17th of December. And then after that I do plan on participating in the historical romance readathon. I'm very excited for this round. I've been in a historical romance mood so I'm like I want to start these books now but I grabbed two. I'm gonna try to get a bingo on the bingo board uh, but I did grab two of the things that I plan on reading. First of which being A Man to Call My Own by Joanna Lindsay. I pulled this one mostly because it is one of the only historical romances I had on my shelf that is a standalone I believe. So I don't really want to be starting too many new series right before the end of the year so I thought I'd grab this one and I believe I'm using this for the prompt of blue on the cover. It obviously works. And then I have one that I am highly anticipating even though it is a first book in a series and that is Love is a Rogue by Lenora Bell. I believe I'm using this for rogue in the title or maybe enemies to lovers. Not sure. One of those. <laughs> Like that's the bingo path I'm taking. Uh, so I'm very excited to get the, to this one. Obviously this would also work for Blue on the cover. And then all month long uh, Rylan who is also the host for the Shelf This Book Club is hosting a readathon within her book club which is the Book Boyfriends Are Better book club. They're just hosting like a winter readathon that also has a bingo board. I'm not sure if I'll be able to hit a bingo on that one. I'm gonna try but I plan on reading a lot of romance this month and I definitely wanted to get to this one while it's like holiday season so I'm gonna be getting to Window Shopping by Tessa Bailey. I've heard this is very steamy and a great holiday read so I'm excited to get to this one. And then lastly this is a romance by a favorite author uh, but my stepmom has been reading through like my copies of what I have by this author and she wants me to bring this one to her for Christmas so I'm gonna try to get to it before I hand it off to her and it is One True Loves by Taylor Jenkins Reid. So I know this will fit in somewhere to get me a prompt on the bingo board as well and yeah that is a very romance heavy month. I'm looking forward to getting to these. I'm by no means going to be pushing myself to read like way too much this month. I just have so much stuff going on, so much stuff to get ready, but I'm ready. I'm excited. Thank you so much for spending some time with me today and I will see you again very soon. Bye!